months ago, we saw Darth Vader secure his first Sith lightsaber. With the release of Darth Vader issue number 12, we finally got to see Vader create his original trilogy lightsaber. So this video, I want to talk about how Vader got his first Sith lightsaber and how he turned it into his original trilogy saber. You're fulfilling your destiny. So a little background knowledge first. The Sith don't create their lightsabers from scratch like the Jedi typically do. In Darth Vader issue number one, we're told Sith aren't given their lightsaber. They take it, and in order to make a red blade, they make a kyber crystal, a living thing pulsing with light side energy, feel pain, and bleed. Now when I say take, I don't mean they find a lightsaber and then make it bleed. No, they need to kill a Jedi and take theirs. To this end, Palpatine sent Vader on a quest to find a Jedi that survived Order 66 and take his lightsaber. This led Vader to a mid-rim Jedi outpost and him killing a lot of people. To go through archives to find a Jedi that took the bearish vow, a vow where the Jedi swears to refrain from activities related to the Order, and complete disengagement from anything but the Force as a type of penance before the Purge. He succeeds in finding such a Jedi. Kirik Infula, a man that hadn't been active in the Jedi Order for years and whose single purpose had been to fight. So Vader goes to the location and the two men begin to fight. And honestly, I think the Jedi was half a wreck because he was way too excited about having a battle to the death. The Jedi wrecks Vader at first since he's still getting used to being in his new suit and has to piece his body together as he takes damage. Actually, a pretty awesome couple panels in itself. However, Vader wins when he shows Sith don't fight fair, and the Jedi becomes unfocused from the fighting, trying to save civilian lives. That is his downfall. Vader takes the Jedi's lightsaber, force chokes him, and drowns the people down below. Having taken the lightsaber from a Jedi he killed, he moves on to the next step bleeding it. Palpatine had instructed some droids to take control of Vader's ship once he obtained his Jedi lightsaber and to take him to a very special location, Mustafar. His master claimed that Mustafar was a unique place and that deep beneath its surface was a locus for the dark side of the Force and that it was there he would reclaim himself. From the sight of his greatest defeat, he would rise strong, unbroken, and powerful. So Vader landed on Mustafar, found a location where the dark side called to him, used its power with his own to bend the kyber crystal to his will. This required corrupting the crystal, teaching it his anger and pain, making it bleed until it sang the hymn of darkness. This was more challenging than Vader thought as the crystal began to fight back. It showed Vader the error of his ways and a vision of what his life could be if he killed Palpatine and turned back to the light. However, Vader refused that path, pouring his anger, hate, sorrow, and every ounce of misery into the crystal, until the pain was so great, it began to bleed. Successfully turning the Jedi's kyber crystal into one worthy of the Sith, Vader revealed his first Sith lightsaber to Palpatine. But if you notice, his saber hilt isn't his original trilogy one. He used the Jedi's lightsaber build for a while until an assassination attempt. While following what turns out to be a false lead on the location of a Jedi, Vader entered a trap and bounty hunters attempted to kill him. They used a tractor rifle to pull Vader's lightsaber away and when he tried to use the force to pull it back to him, the hilt was destroyed. After he had successfully lived through the attempt on his life and after reclaiming the kyber crystal from the broken lightsaber, Vader took time on his ship to make a new lightsaber hilt with the kyber crystal he had already made bleed. Upon returning to Coruscant, Palpatine asked to see it and agreed that the new hilt was an improvement and that the one he took from the Jedi just didn't suit him. And this new hilt was his original trilogy build.